So the last time I did this was how to get from Philly to New York City. In this video, I'm going to do how to get from Philly to Atlantic City. So yeah. Looks like there's going to be one. Only two ways. Or three actually. Yeah, Market Frankfurt is the only involved in, involved in this in those three ways. So anyway, let's go ahead and start the video. So the first thing you wanted to do is to take the Market Frankfurt line from Tioga Station. Let me go ahead and open it up. Okay. So what you're going to start is from Tioga Station, right there, and you go all the way to, or actually before we start, if you want to do a, a bus way, you could do that. So anyway, you wait at Tioga Station, 69th Street bound, and you go all the way to either 8th Street, 11th Street, or 13th Street. Once you get off of those one of those three stop stations, either eighth, eleventh, or thirteenth, exit the station, go wait for the bus at the Market Street. Make sure you go on like a westbound. And then once you wait for the bus, you must wait for about five fifty one from Philly to Atlantic City. Yeah, it's the New Jersey Transit bus. So somewhere around there, and they do make like make multiple stops in Philly. They normally they used to okay so they used to start at the Greyhound station, but they don't do that no more for some reason. So anyway, so you wait at Market Street, and you go all the way to well at Camden Walt at Walter Ryan Transportation Center. They're gonna be taking a break. They're gonna do the layover sometimes. And then what they normally stop is at Avenue Park and Ride in Atlantic City. They sometimes stop at Gloucester Premium Outlet or Frank Plaza. But sometimes they sometimes they could stop at both Gloucester Outlet and Frank Service Plaza. And it only costs you thirty dollar for a round trip. This is the um, fare information for the Route 551. So that means for adult one way is eighteen dollar. The senior one is eight twenty. So let's say like either fifteen something dollar for a senior and child as a round trip from Philly to Atlantic City. There is an option for excursion tickets, which is only cost you twenty dollar. So that means you will be saved ten dollar. If you use the excursion ticket, I think this is only happens if you is in summertime. So yeah, and there's also a um, fare zones, and there's the information that I, the excursion tickets that I'm talking about. So yeah. And once you get to Atlantic City, you, you get off the bus now because it's their final destination. And that is the one way how to get from Philly to Atlantic City. Another way, a bus and tr train and a bus, you must start at Tioga Station, 69th Street bound, go all the way to 8th Street, get off at 8th Street. Take the Paco high speed line. Yes, yeah, actually upside down. Take the take this train. Yeah, this is the one that does that ticket us the fact they wanna purchase a round trip ticket from Eighth and Market to Broadway, which is on Waltheran. On my way back to Philly, for some reason they don't want to accept my ticket. So that means I had to purchase a new one, which has only cost me $3 just to exit a station. 
That's what, okay, so that's kind of a ripoff. Two dollar ripoff. It should be like a dollar or fifty cent just to get out of the station by using a ticket. So that means that sh that two that should be like a two dollar ripoff. Anyway, once you get into the Chapaco train at Aether Market, you must get off all the way to um, Lindenwood. I would have had a schedule, but apparently they don't have it. So once you get off at Lindenwald, you must take the route 554 from Lindenwald to Atlantic City. And this is how many stops they go through. The number 13 is the Atlantic City. Sometimes they may, not, they may probably stop here, which is uh, Atlantic Ave, uh, South Carolina Ave. And I will show you the um, ticket price or the fare. Alright, here's the price. So that means Zone 1 is Landon Wall. So that means Zone 12 is the Atlantic City for the Route 554. And it only costs you $7.10 for one way. And I don't know how many how much is for the round trip for both senior and child and adult. But for one way senior and child will be $13.15. And this is the holiday service. So yeah, so they probably just they probably do runs on those holidays. I don't know about I didn't even check the 551. So yeah. And this is how you get from Philly to Atlantic City by taking a pack in the 554. Going on a train. You do that. But you might gonna have to walk like Ten or five blocks, and you also have to pass through the bus station. So anyway, what you must need to do is to buy that Tioga station, go all the way to Thirtieth Street. Then once you get off at Thirtieth Street, you go through the Amtrak station, which is called Thirty William the Third Thirtieth Street. And you wait for this train, Atlantic City Line. This is they make stop at Pensacola, Cherry Hill, Lindenwald, Atco, Hamilton, Ed Harper, Upson, whatever that is, and then Atlantic City. I think I think this is only like cost you ten dollar for a round trip. I think I don't, I'm not sure, but yeah, only like ten dollars and seventy five cent. For, to go all the way to um, Atlantic City. But apparently, I don't know how much. Okay, wait. They do have that. I don't know if this is Kansas. Yeah. Yeah, but I don't know anything. I don't know if, how much it will be for a round trip. Just to get from Philly to Atlantic City. Alright, uh, this is Philly. 30th Street. Yeah. So this is only like a three way. How to get from Philly to Atlantic City. Thank you guys for watching, meet you guys in the next video.